music producer, mixing engineer. Come. All right, this secret, this tip I'm going to give you is going to help your mixing, in particular, your reverbs. How to put your reverbs on real time. We have two methods of doing this calculation. Do you prefer the simple one first or the simple one? All right, just kidding. This Let's start with the hard one first. On. It's for a friend of mine, so I just want to use this song as an example to show us how to, you know, sort out this issue. So I'll play this song, you hear how the song sounds without a reverb on it and all of that. Then we move on from there. Love you, they consume me. So baby, come close, let me hold you. There is something I want to show you. Your body, they control me. Your love, you, they consume me. So baby, come close, let me hold you. There is something I want to show you. I know fit go. All right, this is it. So now I'm going to apply the the reverbs uh i'm using um <clears throat> vahala i'm gonna apply it now and then you hear it without me applying the decay and the pre-delay so you hear how it sounds this is it close let me hold you there is something i want to show you your body they control me your love they consume me just so imagine baby, come close let me hold you there is something i want to show you now imagine you applying this format of reverbs on all your folks how is it going to sound like so how do we get to do that now this is where the math part comes in this is where the math part comes in so i will need to get my calculator the calculator so this is it all you need to do is very simple put this number in your head 60,000 divides the tempo, divides by the tempo of the beat. So this beat is um, 105. So I know a lot of you are asking questions, where did you get 60,000 from? 60,000 makes one, makes one bar. You know, 60,000 milliseconds make one bar. So one bar is made by 60,000 milliseconds. So that is how we derive with the 60,000 um, number. So once you um, divide 60,000 with the temple of the beat, it's going to give you, um, hold on, 60,000 divided by 105. It's going to give you 571 there about so now 571 is too much for your decay even your decay is not up to that amount so what you need to do is now you multiply you multiply i want my decay to be around you know two two to three you know repress the, the best place that suits my decay well, I want to work on this song to be around two point something, and that is where it's supposed to be. So once you do what you do is you times that number, you times it with two, then you get one point one four two. Now one point one four two is too low for the song, you know, for the decay. So I'm going to times it again with two. You times, you get. 2.285 and this is perfect for me this is what i want for this particular song so all i need to do is i'll go to my um reverb my uh decay i'll put in 2.3 so once i put in 2.3 it's going to automatically give me 2.30 seconds milliseconds uh 30 seconds yeah they're about so now that is for my decay that is for my decay now i need to get my pre-delay a lot of people don't know about this but i'll give it i'll give it to you for free i'll go back to my calculator i'll come with that same number again sixty thousand divides by the tempo of the beat gives you five seven one they're about now Instead of you to multiply, you're going to divide. Divide by 4. So it's going to give you 142. Now, 
I don't want my pre-delay to be above 100. I want it to be below 100. So 142 is not for me. It's not going to work for me. So what I need to do, I need to divide it again with 2. Divide 142 is going to give me 1. It's going to give me 71. Now, I feel 71 is cool because I still want the pre-delay to apply because of the kind of songs, sort of the kind of song I'm working on. So I think one at 71 is cool for the song. So I need, all I need to do is to sum the number up and I'm going to put 72 there. Now, I'll play it for you. Now you can tell the difference. I'll play it for you so you can tell the difference. So now this is it. I know fit go if you let go. Your love is killing now me see slowly. How it's go. working on real time. Okay, your body they control me. You can feel it that your this is in a real time. Me. So baby, come close, let me hold you. There is something I want to show you. Your body they control. So guys, this is where I'm gonna stop for today. And on my next video, this is where I'm gonna stop. On my next video. I will show you the more simpler way to go about this follow for part two all right guys thanks very much and i hope this helps and um, if you have any questions please drop it on the comment and i will sure to reply thanks and have a great day